Right, of course, there's still more reaction coming in on Ketlas Tolle's axing as National Police Commissioner. We speak now to Zandi Lemachosi, the Inkata Freedom Party spokesperson on police. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Zandi, for your time here on Newslink. Now, of course, uh, I think this is a question that I was asking the previous uh, political party leader that I spoke to. The president did allude in his State of the Nation address that there would be changes in terms of our security cluster. Were you expecting it to be the police commissioner or were there other people you were expecting to also exit? Uh, thank you. Thank you so much, uh, Maseko. Uh, as the IFP, we were expecting that uh, um, uh, National Commissioner Astrole will be exit. Why am I saying this? Um, on the report of the president, I think it was about uh, last year, maybe uh, three months back, when he asked the National Commissioner to bring reasons why he shouldn't uh, suspend him from his position. It turns you then at that time that, which means the president had already taken sides, that uh, the National Commissioner is the one that must be responsible and that must take accountability and not the minister. Because if that was the case, then he would have asked both the minister and the national commissioner to bring reasons why he shouldn't let them go. By that only, we knew that uh, uh, the only person that will be a uh, casualty here or that will be asked is the national commissioner. Mm. Now, uh, judging from what you're saying, um, I would assume that you believe that he should have gotten rid of both the commissioner as well as the minister. All right, I think there's an audio issue with Zandi Lemachosi. No, 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 yeah, yeah, it, uh, it was my, it was my, my, <laughs> yeah, technology. Okay. Uh, but yeah, we, I mean, if, if, if there's someone that, um, if there are people that should be, uh, that should take accountability, it's the leadership of the police. Once we've got the minister as um, a person who presides over the department of uh, police, then he must also take accountability for any, Thing that uh, uh, happens in the police department, also with the national commissioner. So if only one has to then um, be the one that accounts and the other one does not account, it does not make any sense. Why, why would you want to ask the other one and then leave the other one? Because if you want reasons why they couldn't work together, then you must find them. That why were they, were, they were so... Uh, uh, um, they couldn't work uh, uh, together. They were at locker heads all the time when they had to work together. So uh, why do you only ask the national commissioner and not give reasons? Why are you still leaving the minister in, in the department and, and, and still serving there? But also he has failed by, 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 by the department. He has failed South Africans. They couldn't uh, uh, um, bring the unrest and looting of the last year, July. So why, why, why do you leave him? Why do you access Tolle only? There are reasons that then you should give us as the president that, which means as a country, you only believe that National Commissioner is the one that was responsible and not the minister. Mm. What are your thoughts about this position of the National Police Commissioner? Is it politicized? I mean, if you look at what happened to Minister Peggy Tele, uh, when he was um, a police commissioner, he left in a dark cloud. Although he was exonerated by a court later, fact remains is that when he left, he had a dark cloud over his head. And then we had your Ria Piecha, and then we had your Komoto Patlani, and now Ketlas Tole, General Ketlas Tole. What do you make of this particular position of a National Police Commissioner? Do you think there's politics at play when it comes to it? The position, Maseko, has no problem. The position is there. It's placed so that there is leadership in the police department and that the, uh, there's a person who must then take accountability and make sure that uh, the lives of South Africans are protected at all times. But as we, as we are saying now, that it's almost, uh, I think it's five now, national commissioners that have, um, have not even finished their term. So it tells you that there's a political thing that is going on between ministers and the national commissioner, and it is not correct because South Africans do not need uh, politics that will be brought inside, inside the police department, but they need a police department that will always be able to protect them. And they will always have faith and believe that this police department is able to, to, to bring our priorities at hand. But we can see that with what is happening at the current moment, that um, it's obviously a political thing that is happening that we do not know about, because as the, as the committee we had tried several times last year to, to, to bring the, 
these lockdown, these lockerheads with the minister and the national commissioner, that they should work together. Irregardless whether you love each other or you don't love each other, it's not about that. It's about protecting South Africans. But they have not done that, and uh, they've both failed in terms of doing that because they've both not shown leadership to South Africans and 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 also not bought and believe that they can protect South Africans. So this po this position has no problem at all. The problem is politicizing it. Mm. Uh, just very quickly, what are your thoughts then on this particular um, decision by the president to ax uh, Kehlas Tolle? Do you think that was the correct decision? Do you think he does deserve to be uh, removed from that position? Um, I, would, I would not say what, uh, but as the IFP, what I will say is that uh, we think that the president was not uh, 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 rational about it and was not uh, truthful on this exing uh, uh, um, um, uh, uh, national commissioner's toilet. Because if people have to take responsibilities, the minister and the national commissioner, and if the minister and the national commissioner are not speaking to each other, are not working together, when that, then obviously it will mean that that department will not work. It's a department that will be in disagreement. So once you get that, then you must bring both leaders into accountability, and they must both be responsible for everything that goes on with, within the uh, police department. But if you can't do that and then you bring one side, which means you are telling us that you are taking one side of, of the story and not listening to the other. And now coming with the reasoning that um, they've, uh, they've reached a consensus with the National Commission. I mean, why would you want to reach a consensus with the National Commission when you wanted reasons from the National Commissioner only and you did not want any reason from the minister and you did not expect the minister to take accountability on that? So we think that they should have been asked, both of them, uh, if, if, if it's a part of uh, uh, accountability, so we can see that this thing is just politicized. It's a politics that is playing here at hand, and unfortunately the National Commissioner had to be a casualty in this one.